it looks like one of our members has gone on a little break. Oh well, he'll be back. Because currently we're working with TJ's character. Okay. So, Aired, you're going to the shady part of town, the southeast. Correct. All right. Wait, east? I thought you said west. Oh, God damn it. No, southeast. Um, so, yeah, how are you going to go about trying to find a black market? I guess I'm going to look for someone sh shady. Someone, someone shady. I'm, I'm thinking someone who might not, who might obviously be conducting bad business, too obviously, and then. Okay, so someone who looks like they might conduct not, business of something other than just legal means. Like I'm thinking maybe some, someone on the street who's doing gambling games. Okay, you they tend you to be distrustful. Okay, you find a gambler on the, uh, and he he's he looks a bit destitute, but he has he has a dice game going. Okay, he's like, hey, do you want to play some dice? Sure. As what game is this one? As as you say, sure. You can, he smiles, and you can see it like all of his teeth right here are missing. And he's like, okay. And so, uh, he says the rules are simple. You just roll the dice and see how many you get that are of a kind. And then you guess as to how many there are of mine. So it's like Yahtzee, but I'm trying to guess what he has. Yes. So, so the point of me rolling? Because you have to guess. Uh, have you seen uh, the parts of the Caribbean movies? It's Liar's Dice. Uh, I'm just going to roll and see what happens for, for the first round. Okay. Uh-oh. Are we in combat? Do no. I need to ready a spell? He is in a gambling situation. Oh! Okay. I'm a rogue. I can handle myself. Oh, God. Sure. So I'm gonna roll what slate of hands. I mean, you are. You are the guy. I'm, 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 no, I mean, do I have to roll something or is it? Well, you're playing a game. I just want you to roll five d six. Okay. Then. Okay. Yeah, that's above average. I'm going to cover that with my hand. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and guess what I have. How many of a single number do you think I have? I'm going to guess three. Of? Three. Three of three. Threes. Okay. I'm going to guess you have two twos. All right. Show him. I and as it. and as he uh, lifts his up, you can see that he rolled a six, a six, a two, a four, and a one. And you rolled two twos. You chose poorly. Okay. And I did cover that up with my hand, just so you know. I, I was actually surprised that you, you guessed it right. <laughs> I won. Would you like to play again for double? Oh, There's by the way, a single game is three copper. I had a mystery copper. Much obliged. I tell him he could have told me that before we started, so I could have shown him I actually had three copper. No, oh, you could have. But like I can. An evil lucky charms guy. I heard that you're. <laughs> Would you like to pay some more? <laughs> I just sure. Changed. This time I'm. I'm going to use some slate of hands to try and roll every dice the same number. Okay. If that's possible. Okay. Uh, roll sleight of hand, I guess, somehow. <laughs> Let me get over here so you guys see it. 
Okay, yeah, you can uh, roll uh, 1d6. You can fudge all six dice. All right. To whatever you want to be. Okay. A... This game's for six, Copper. This time I tell him, you're going to guess my dice. And if you get it wrong, you're going to give me some information. About what? About the black markets. I haven't heard of any black markets. I can tell you that right off the bat. Hey, you want to play or not? I, I just roll my dice. Okay. Did you roll it? Uh, since since you're fudging it, just manually input it into that chat. I'm just gonna put the one number, and they're all gonna be the same. Okay. That. They're all sevens. <laughs> <laughs> if they're all sevens, I'm gonna smack you. All right, you want me to guess first? Yes. Three fours. Guess mine. Same thing. Oh, we well, got it wrong. Show yours. I reveal all six dice to be sixes. Well, that's a lucky roll. Now give me money. In my my information. Okay. Well, none of us lost any money, and I already gave you information. I haven't heard of any black markets. I'm gonna roll a perception to see if he is bullshitting me. Uh, that would be insight. Insight. Yeah. Sorry. You can't tell. For all you Why? know, he's telling the truth. I thank him for his time, and I move on. Hey. Hey, who else wants to gamble? <laughs> and he, he just goes on along like that. Okay. Uh, and just so you know, uh, TJ, you are a rogue. One of your things is thieves can't. Oh, shit, you're right. Do you remember what that is? Yeah, the thieves language. Yeah, it's a special thieves language. Just so you know. How far away would people be able to hear me if I use it? Well, that's the thing about Thieves Can't. Nobody knows it's Thieves Can't. It's just normal talk. I mean, that'd be it's how far away can I actually f can a thief that knows it hear me from? Normal talking distance. Yeah. It's just Unless talk you're yelling. It's just talking and basically giving secret code words meaning something else. Okay, I'm going like to use that to see if I can see any thief or can you count, I, track I down like a thief. The rhyming slang. It's something. Just come up with something that's not dirty or innuendo-ish. Round peg goes into the square also. hole hard with a hammer. God damn it, Pat. This is why Dave is not playing a rogue. <laughs> Yet. That and I'm not stealthing. So I'm going to use Fuse Can't to see if there's any. All right. Nearby. So give me a random phrase that you want to use uh, saying that you would like to find the black market, or access the black market. Uclay in the Ag Bay. Because that's not gonna be noticeable at all. I don't know. The crow calls at noon. There you go. Do you want to use that one? Perfect. Okay, the crow calls at noon. Bam. Okay, that is in my notes now. For that to happen later. What? Yep, that's us, and that is a green cup. At least it's not duck. It, it's a cup. Okay. So, uh... You are going around, and you, uh... Go by a local, uh... Market, where the, just a street market, where there's, like, vendors of all kinds. There's, like, general vendors, and, and uh, a meat market, and such. And just various foods... Uh, what? <laughs> what are you they're, doing? They're, they're talking about hand gestures in chat. I was just... Oh, dear. The butterfly. Um. <laughs> okay. Awkward turtle. I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> well, that crosses everything out. Thanks, Omega. 
But, okay. As you get to this marketplace, you, uh, you just start, you just say it. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, some pops out, uh, one of the local vendors, and he says, um, hold on, let me, let me make this thing. Uh, Ludwig, quick, give me a response to the crow's, co the crow calls at noon. What? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. You're you're the one creating the, the people. The crow calls at noon only when only when ravens are above. There. Jeez. It's not the greatest, but it's the best I came up with on the spot. That's great. Thank you much. Okay. That was creepy. Uh, <laughs> okay. So a uh, a merchant that you passed by. Uh, I already forgot what it was. Hold on. Merchant that you pass by says only when the ravens are above, and you recognize that it's Steve's can and that he's clearly a uh, part of this. So I approach him and uh, initiate a conversation. He says, "What are you looking for?" I was just by uh, the tailor uptown, and there was an explosion. We think it may have been related to powders might have been bought somewhere. <laughs> We'll assume you know, this I, is I, all in I, Thieves' Cant. Yes. I, I'm not very patient with... <laughs> and and that's what Ludwig did the thing for, because you're talking about it, obviously. Uh, we're assuming this is all... You think would understand subtlety. We're <laughs> assuming, <laughs> we're assuming okay, this is all in Thieves' Cant. Take your headphones off. <laughs> we'll do how that another you, time. How would you Thieves', thieves Cant the word explosion? Boom hey. shakalaka, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Bazongas. Hey, it's just, no, just I just imagine it being every fifth word or something. Oh dear. Hey. Yeah, you can do that. It doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, but uh, yeah, this is on Thieves Camp. And he says, "Yeah. Uh, are you looking to buy?" I, I'm looking to track some down. Yes. Okay. Uh. That'll be 50 gold. So you have some? Or you want... I might. I might not. Do you want or the explosive or the information? I was asking if you're trying to sell me the item or the information. You want an information? Yes. I'm selling you information. All right. Just so we're... Just making sure. Okay. I was thinking that would be way too easy. Money first. Yeah. Let me scroll down here. And they said 50 gold. I only have 33. Oh, too sad. You could always ask him to stick around or like a calling card or something. Bargain? So can come get Isn't me. that something a thief can do is bargain? Or that! It's up to TJ. <laughs> I know it is. I'm, I'm Did, helping train. Who took the... The antidote to the poison from the witch. Who took the what? The what that? She made it. No, she gave us some extras, did she not? Yeah, she did. Who had? Who took them? Ludwig. When? So that's not an option. I see ramen. <laughs> you 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 probably know what I was what <laughs> I was thinking of doing. Uh, you're gonna try and trade? Oh no, I know what you're doing now. I was almost going to do poison the guy and then offer him the vial mm -hmm. of antidote. Yeah. Which would have been a huge ass to move, but. Good luck trying to get it in. Okay. <laughs> so, uh. <laughs> shoot. God. Jelly. <laughs> Good luck. Uh, I like how everything I say can be taken in a different way. <sighs> like, Go, I'm, go eating, to them. I'm, I'm not think commenting about getting it. Okay, you're going to think of it? Okay, so we are back at the guild uh, house now. We're going. I'm just going to guild something, guild headquarters. Um, so, yeah, Where what are you guys doing? Eating. You're, okay, you're still eating. Still guarding. You're still guarding. Uh, okay. As far as I know, they have not arrived, to my knowledge. Shane, are you doing anything? 
Is there a bar in the third line? It, no. Damn. Um, Remember, they don't offer alcohol. They haven't given you a reason yet. Is our guildmaster back yet? Uh. Sorry, I'm really. Yes. Here. Okay. Yes, she's back. They're still standing guard, though. They're oh, just more scattered I, around now. I, I would be uh, asking how the, how her visit with the parents went if she returned. It went well. They're actually very. They're very glad we took her under our protection. Uh, sings how we were the one who cured her, um, and that we are, and that we're not charging for one. Uh, they're they're very happy to see that we're willing to take things in our own hands um, on such short notice, and for free. What's your name again? Riley. Riley, thank you. Yep. Riley, I have a question for you. Yes. Sorry, I is there a black market in this town? And uh, obviously there probably is, but yeah, the there's size, a black market. Because what blew up the house was a uh, uh, alchemic mix of explosion powder. Okay. So, based on the knowledge I have of it, it's not easy to make nor come by, so um black market is my first thought of where it could be. Okay, I haven't, I haven't specifically heard of any explosive being able to be sold in the black market, but I, it's feasible. I've, I've heard about it. It's not very common that you um, hear about such things, but possible. Yes. Do we have somebody that uh, keeps our ear to the ground about these sort of matters? Let me check the names real quick. Uh, da da da. -da. Thankfully, I have details on these people. Da, 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 da. Where's old? The best person for this would be Mira. Oh, okay. <laughs> By the way, I, I, I will audibly sigh at the mention. <laughs> by the way, you may want to teach her how to clean. <sighs> She's always that way. I know. Does does your poor armor blacksmith know that? Yes. Okay. He does. Is it a mirror free zone down there? I take it. Currently. why the upstairs gets wrecked. <laughs> yeah. That's one reason why I stay around all the time rather than going out on jobs myself. <laughs> because you have so oh, I would rather have a place to come back to. Rather than a whirlwind disaster area. Have you seen the library? I restored it once. I'm not doing it again. Actually, I've restored it twice now. Once when I wrecked it, and the other time when she wrecked it. Mm -hmm. She doesn't often clean, and then there's often books in the rafters, and, and sometimes it's down here, and... Mm -hmm. It wouldn't surprise me if you look in a tree outside that there's a book in there. She doesn't like going outside. Okay. The only okay. time she goes outside is at night. Ah. Empire. What? <laughs> Obviously, if she goes out at night, she's a vampire. Are, are you, oh, are, wow, you, are you saying one. this right now? Next to the paladin. Are you saying this right now? In character? <laughs> Am I doing it in my accent? No. Okay. <laughs> it's hard to tell. <laughs> I, you want to go, mate? I'll hook you in Gabba. Swear on me more. We'll go go to the backers right now. We'll fight this out. With, with, <laughs> with what accent? Which one are you going to fight with? Australian. Okay. From a country. Did you say country? <laughs> Arcanus, where's Alm? Uh, well, we'll go up, I'm going to go upstairs and talk to... Oh God! <laughs> Why am I getting the shit jobs today? And I say that out loud too. 
am I talking to like literally the people with the most? Oh, I've already been to the. Herbal. You haven't talked to me yet. Riley <laughs> actually pats you on the head. <laughs> Where, where's our rogue? Your room? Our rogue went looking for the black market, I think. On his own? And if they have blasting powder, isn't that a bit dangerous? Well. It can stop, I'm pretty it's sure, fine. I'm pretty, sure some, I'm pretty sure if someone wanted her, wanted someone dead, they probably would have stuck around to see and probably would have seen us at some point. Quite possibly, but also, uh, no. they knew they would get this kind of attention. So I don't know what the goal would be, other than destroying evidence of something. I don't know. That's why I'm going to go talk to my lovely lady upstairs and probably die in a avalanche of books. So I'll be back. And I wave and go upstairs. Okay. Uh, does anybody else do anything? Like, follow him or anything? Uh, I'll yeah. go with him for moral support at this point. <laughs> and I'm bored and I want to see a rumble, so... And you want to see a rumble. Okay. So you go upstairs, and uh, you see that she's uh, hanging upside down in the rafters, uh, reading a book, <laughs> obviously. This time about the extraplanar deities. Mm. Anything interesting? Uh, maybe. Shayna, you hey. notice Mira lock eyes with you. She flips down, closes her book, and just walks up to you and starts looking at you in the eyes. Which you is pretty easy to do. I just imagine her saying, Mommy? <laughs> no. She's actually taller. Yeah. And, and what do you say? Is three foot four. Oh, I was making a joke. <laughs> and, and, and what'd you say to her? Dude, you're right, Les. <laughs> Where are you from? North Korea. I, I look at Mira. I haven't heard of that country. I've been that for a while now. It's all over the place. Good I luck. haven't heard of that country. Where is this North Korea? I need popcorn for this. <laughs> it's from the north. Our her friends are from there. What? We are <laughs> just the Swedish chef known on that halfway through? Herp and derp. <laughs> I look at Mira and I was like, you won't be able to start her accent. We haven't figured out where it's from either. It changes okay. more often than you change books. <laughs> and she actually... Hmm. Well, you're up here. Do you need anything? Yes. Uh, black markety stuff. The explosion that we heard, uh -huh. heard was caused by... Uh, Alchemy. Yeah. It was called by a blasting powder. Mm -hmm. I need to know if uh, there's any place in town that uh, that can be bought, sold, traded, acquired. Well, <laughs> I just see someone say, huh? What did she say in chat? Um, well, it isn't very often that they sell blasting powder just because it makes a, it makes a big scene. Yes. <laughs> Kind of draws attention to an area. And it would draw attention to said illegal activities mm -hmm. that otherwise are generally accepted, like exotic goods, that sort of thing. Yeah. Um, on rare occasion, there's poison. But blasting powder, they tend not to sell that. Do you know anybody around here that might make it or know how to make it? Because the... The herbalist was about as helpful as Ross, uh, Moss on a Rock. Which herbalist? Mr. Excitable. Haven't heard of him. Okay. The, oh, I can't remember. I think name. Dave Willis. forgot the name. I did. Yeah. Willis. What's the name? Willis. 
<laughs> That's the same reaction I had. He's and good. And now there's a dent in his door because I've hit my head against it enough times. He's good. Just. Yeah. I think you get you the picture. Know. He doesn't. He doesn't know too much except what goes on in his shop and what goes into his shop and out of his shop. That's really all he knows. That's why I'm asking you. I don't know of any shipments coming in uh, currently. Although I... Ask what? Do you know any that have come in? Uh, I don't know any that have come in. Uh, What I can do is I usually make the rounds at night and uh, among my contacts and I can see what they have brought up. Anything would be useful because honestly the only reason why I can think of that they would blow the place up is one, it was an accident and somebody forgot they had a vial of powder on them but that would just take a lot of ineptitude. Just a bit. Or B, somebody wanted to erase something. Well, or they C, could have had it slipped onto them. Yeah. You know, or C, they wanted to cause a distraction from elsewhere. So if you hear about any other strange activities that happened today, let us know. Yes. Thank you. And I is is the room a mess? I take it. Obviously. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> you, you know what? As thank you, I will clean up your mess for you. But I'm reading all these. Are you reading all of them? What all about of them. right now? Are you reading all of them right now? She opens no, her book and starts reading. <laughs> she opens her book and starts reading. I take another book and put it on her head. <laughs> <And> walk away. <laughs> she kind of giggles and just sits down. <laughs> I go back down. I cleaned up a little. <laughs> oh, good. All. She's reading them all right now. And this now, is Riley yeah. now. Oh, good. Yeah. I put one on her head. That's cleaning up right now. I don't think she would let me clean up the books. She's you know, she's going to think the information is going to absorb into her head, right? Maybe that will help. Oh, that's a good... Be right back. I run upstairs. <laughs> and I start digging through. Uh, what? <laughs> I, I dig through the mess to find the cleanliness book real quick and put it on her head. <laughs> Mira's just like... What is okay? <laughs> I I just put I just put a self help book on how to be cleanliness. How okay. To be clean okay. Uh, you know what? I'm just there gonna let go. that go. I'm not gonna make it roll anything. <laughs> okay. I helped her <laughs> in the same way that I want to help Willis. Okay, so now we are back. Uh, is there anything else you want to do? Um. Hmm. All of y'all. Except for TJ, because I know what he's about to. Do. Um, at, at this point, at this point, questioning why I was sent to this guild, but okay. <laughs> is uh, Mina awake, or is she still unconscious? Uh, Mina is still unconscious right now. Okay. It's only been a couple hours. Okay. I'm going to resume my post in front of the door. Okay. And Shayna huggles cats. Evil. <laughs> uh. Okay. So, TJ, do you know what you're trying to do now? I was debating trying to pawn off the vial of poison, but I might, that might cause more issues in the future. Because I'm thinking... So, are you trying to haggle with him? I'm going to try and haggle with him, yes. Okay. Alright. What do you have to offer? It needs to be something worth selling. Now, you're asking for information that's dangerous. Why don't you just give me something dangerous in return? I might have changed his accent, but I don't care right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's now a dwarf. He's now I a dwarf. Pull, you know what? I pull out the violet poison. What's that? It's a poison which we've recently found in wolves. Nobody know. Very few people know about it. But... From what I'm told by the witch, it is very deadly. Mm. 
Rare poison, you say? The only antidote we, I know of is currently on a personal friend of mine. What's this poison do? But I, uh, I cannot remember what you told us from a few episodes. It's because you don't know. <laughs> You're going to have to guess. I'm going to try to use deception. Okay. And bullshit him. Okay. Roll. 13. Uh, okay, what are you trying to make him think it is? One of the deadliest things in the world, essentially. All right, Bro, now... I'm so okay, sorry. Uh, okay, okay. okay. Don't buy buried, so, something that can be used with little detection that might ever trace back to him or whoever used it. Ah, uh, so a hidden poison. Yeah. But you said it came from those wolves. Those wolves aren't very hidden, nor do they do very, anything very hidden at all. Why would they use a poison of anything? They're just wolves. They're just diseased us all. So you're telling me that you're trying to give me something that these wolves, something that's coming from these wolves that are, that are diseased. Is that right? These wolves have been eradicated by, by my group personally. Oh, really? This okay. Is the last trace of this in existence. It happens. Oh, well, who's to say that there aren't any more? Hmm. There aren't any nearby. That's for sure. There might be more coming. I could just go get it myself. Now, you might want to offer me a better deal. Now, if you want, I'll take I'll take this, but I'll have to take something else too. As it is, I could do a lot with this, so I don't have to go out there and get my hands dirty. But anything else you have to offer? You know what? If it comes down to it, give me twenty-five gold and this similar to deal. All right. Because clearly, I know this does something. I don't think it is what you're telling me what it is, but it does something. I'll take the 25 gold offer with the poison. Okay, hand it over. I do that. Let's see, how much does that come out to? I feel like this is a really bad I idea. Gold. Well, none of you are with him. <laughs> what? None of you know this is happening. Even given the black market. Meta, meta, meta. Why? Why would we give him? You realize my character poison. has his own in his own agenda too, like all of yours. <laughs> oh, let's see. It's thirty-three down, uh, minus twenty-five. So that's what I'm calculating. Yeah. Eight. Uh, yeah. Eight. Thank you. There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. I'm just. Tired as hell. So if you actually want to get technical, if you have 33 left to hit a bullseye, you need double four to go. And over. he hands you a swatch of cloth as you're handing him the gold. He says, just so you don't have to go searching for everyone. If you ever want to talk to anyone on the black market, just carry this around. And someone will talk to you. So put in your inventory black market uh insignia oh it also doubles if they want to play uh, flag football yeah that hey, too yeah or if you're back in the 60s it's the gay way to indicate uh what you're into but that's beside the all right huh. so the handkerchief in the black back pocket um trivia also, real quick i'm going to uh inquire about um to riley about the signet ring okay uh before that tj anything else you do here uh, ever didn't get the information. Oh, wait, yeah, you gotta give you the information. We didn't have anybody buy specific explosives here, but we did have someone acquire some ingredients that could be combined into an explosive. And who would this be? The people around here call her Harmony. She's a bit of a Well, don't tell her this, but she's a bit of a psychopath. And where can I find her? The best way to find her is to follow the loud noises. So 
Sorry, I'm having to, because I just had the light bulb turn on my head. Sorry. Okay. I, I thought that was some sort of reference. I'm like, no. <laughs> I was thought I I thought he just came up with something like some weird theory. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> Is that a movie a weird reference? Theory, but, but just to simple connect the dots. It's nothing but a theory right now, but I'm pretty sure I'm correct. Uh, Cotton Omega. I'm gonna roll to see if I can actually hear any loud noises that he might be referring to. Like an explosion. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Okay, go ahead and roll. He's referring to explosions. <laughs> no, I'm saying if I can hear any right now. No, you can't. You can't hear anything uh, like explosions. All right. I thank him, and I go try and find the group. I suggest not trying to find her. She's a bit off the hook. Off the hook? As you might say. Off kilter. I did say she's a psychopath, didn't I? Yes, yes, you did. She likes explosions and fire and smoke and acid and various other things you can make with file. Uh, that's Bye so now. I may I also take a mental note of what he looks like for if, you, if I ever see him again. All right. Let's see. Because I know he has a very deadly poison. All right. He never gave you his name, but I will write him down. Like, I want to be... My character wants to be able to recognize him the moment he sees him again. Yeah. So you basically ingrain him into your memory. Exactly. Okay. Sounds good. All right. And, uh, Dave, you were trying to do what? I'm just inquiring about the signet ring and see if Riley knows what it means and okay. what it represents. No. Nothing of any particular interest. Uh, it's just a signet ring. Sometimes people buy these things. Okay, I was just wondering. I didn't know if... Because uh, I don't know if it, it belonged to the shopkeeper. Mm -hmm. It belonged to the tailor. And I didn't know if he was part of some secret hush-hush thing or not. Well, if it is, I haven't heard of it. Okay. See, this is why we have these talks. I like Information's talking. good. Information is good. You want some chicken? Some what? Chicken. Chicken? Yeah. I like... No, no, no. That's a bad gay joke. Bad gay joke. Bad gay joke. I like cock. There. I made the joke. I'm sorry I had to. <sighs> no, I'm kind of upset that Panzer did not want to show, show me the ring earlier. She kind of smiles, tilts her head. And then just turns was, around, just... turns around, grabs Wait. a chicken leg, and puts it in front of you on a plate. Dummy! No, I'm on it. <laughs> chicken. Chicken. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, what do you guys do now? Uh, I assume, uh, TJ, are you on your way here? To the guild hall? I'm assuming, hole? I'm going to guess they're either, that they're at the guild hall, so that's where I'm going. Okay. Okay. So, uh... <laughs> It is about maybe four, five o'clock when uh, Aird gets back. I'm what still leaving. <laughs> I tell him about the information Sweet. and the crazy lady. I was going to say, by the time he gets back, is Mina awake yet? Yes, she would be. And I inquire about Mina if she's awake. Have you been regularly checking up on her? Have you been outside her door or inside? I've been outside the door because I okay. put her in my quarters. Yeah, she's she, she's woken up, but she's just kind of stayed there. Uh, I guess you find out when he inquires about her. I'd like to go into the room and talk to her. I as well would. I, I, calmly, uh, I try to comfort her while asking her if she's okay. Bless you. Well, I'm... Are you going to inform our compatriots that we're doing this? You can. I'm not letting you in without the rest of them here. I don't care. I'm keeping, I'm keeping all precautions right now. You don't trust me? I don't trust anyone. Okay. Then we'll go <laughs> I don't there. trust anyone! <laughs> if, if you didn't trust me, if you just said to me specifically, I'd be like... It seems a bit meta, but everyone I can understand. Meta? 
No, he just wouldn't trust anyone. All right. Uh, so yeah, what do you do? Yeah, we're gonna inform everyone. I'm assuming. Okay. So, do you guys go? No. Shannon. Huh? Do you, <laughs> do you go with the group to talk to Mina? Yeah, sure. Okay. So okay. Before I approach Mina, I give Damien all my possessions to hold on to to help comfort him. <laughs> I don't have anything. Take everything. Just I have out. 25 less gold than I used to have. <laughs> ah. no, ever, no, I like just any items that he might believe could be dangerous. Well, that's up to him. <laughs> if you don't trust me, I can hand you my knives. And as such. long as I have an eye on you, I don't. I'll, I feel that I feel all right. All right, so I approach Mina and ask her if she's okay. How's she feeling? Dizzy. In pain. I hurt. First? Yes. I off I give her some water. She my drinks water it. Skin. I am sorry to have to ask you of this so soon after, but what happened in there? What do you remember? Well, we had this. We had this girl come in. What she looked like. She had. She had long brown hair and, and, and two pigtails, and she. She talked rather strangely, not in accent or anything, just. Not. Hold it! I. I. Right. Politely, well, as politely as I can. Because. Now we're to my brainstorm. Is is that possibly the girl that uh, your dude was talking about? Being the crazy psycho? Probably. What? I made that connection a long time ago. Okay, good. I'm yeah. Proud of you. She, she asked about some dyes, and so we showed her downstairs. And then when she came back up, she she threw something. A and vial of some kind, I would imagine? I guess, and that's all I remember. Thank you. What it close. was, was blasting powder. Do you recognize her? Do you remember what her face looked like? I think, if anything, you'd notice her from the pigtails. Mm hmm. Like, it was clearly down to her waist. I thank her. I feel like this is now we've ventured into another trope. We're um, we're I keeping you here at the guild hall for protection. It's out again. Oh, okay. I when I woke up, I didn't really assume anything, but we wanted to make yeah. precautions, make sure nothing happened. It seems. Have, have you told my parents? Yeah, uh, I believe Riley has told your parents. Oh, and the, it's not going to cost them anything. Oh, thanks. Okay. Um, what did the guy say the what, name was again? What about my boss? How about him? I'm sorry. I'm so lucky. I'm afraid. I'm sorry. We're sorry to inform you, but he did not make it. I can assure you that he did not die a painful death. It was instantaneous. Are you lying? Legitimately, are you lying to this woman? Yes, I'm rolling for deception right now. Okay, go ahead. I mean, one can only assume that an explosion would be... Be thankful that she has a pounding headache. I'm I'm just trying to comfort her. Be thankful that she has a pounding headache and that she only knows that he's dead now. I am shout I You are getting piercing glares from the eight-foot dragon man behind <laughs> Camera. Uh, I'm sorry. There you go. Thank you. She I, I just I was decided to do the focus thing. Um, I, give her, I give her the signet ring. Okay. You stole from. Oh. That don't, was his. I don't know if it means anything. It. But... Not from what he told me. Mm. Okay. But, this means we got to go look for a job again. First, you need to get I better. think you should get better first. Well, I feel... No, I don't feel fine. 
I don't feel fine at all. Um. Ah. Uh, anything else that you want to know? If not, I'd like to try and get some more sleep. How have the uh, Cause villagers been treating ow. you since uh, you come? You came back from the uh, witch. Uh, they've they've been avoiding me for the most part. I assume because these, but I mean, I had a kid throw throw a rock at me once, but that's just a kid being a kid for all I know. Nothing too much happening. But they are avoiding me. And just... I quietly slip out the door while they're talking and go downstairs and talk with Riley about the situation that she's encountering. Okay. With uh, re-entering, talking with the rest of the town's folks. Okay. Do uh, any okay. of you uh, ask more to uh, from uh, Mina? I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to pry too much more. She's had a long day. Okay. I, got I would wait till everyone else left the room before I left the room. Boss, I'm gonna follow Dave. Okay. When we leave the room, I tell him about when she cannot possibly hear about what I learned. Okay, so about the uh, oh, from the from the black market guy. Yeah, I do okay. not tell him about the poison though. Okay. So yeah, you now have that information, Ludwig. No, I tell them all, so they're aware that. Oh, you tell this them all. You all now have that information. <laughs> you have information. Hold it up like Link does. Do you remember what the name was? Da, 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 da. Harmony. 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 Forgot to write it down. Because I'm an idiot. I would like to go uh, talk to Riley and ask her if she knows this name. I'll go deal with Mina on the situation. So Dave doesn't have to. With Mina? Just Mira. 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 The other okay. one. Yeah, just be prepared for the usual. Okay. okay Audible so... groans like usual. <laughs> so who's doing what right now? I'm talking to Riley and... Okay, Dave, what were you doing? Uh, I was going to go talk to Riley real quick about the problems that... Okay, uh... two people talking to Riley. Major? Um, just going with, uh, Pen uh Dave. Following him around. With Dave. Okay, and, uh, Ludwig, Dave. you're talking to... Me now. I mean, Mina. Mira. 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 The names are so goddamn familiar. <laughs> All part of his evil plan. Little, 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 little. Okay, so, who wants to go first? They can go first. Okay. Dave, go first, because you asked. Oh. Okay. Up there. Riley, um, is it possible that you could help Mina find another job after this? The She's a tailor, right? Very, yeah, the town folks aren't helping too well with this. They're acting scared of her because of the cat eyes, I imagine. Oh, so you think she won't be able to get one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's, let's see what happens, uh, and I'll see what I can do. Okay. Because I know you have pretty good sp sphere of influence around here. They might be more willing to talk with you about it. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll see what I can do. If anything, I can put out a recommendation, or if it, if worse comes to worst, I can... Hire her here. We have a blacksmith who's in armor and a weaponsmith. We can always have a tailor. That's true. And the guild grows some more. Hmm. The thick plottens. Hmm. The, th the thick the plottens. Did you get you caught that? I'm so glad. <laughs> uh. The thick plottens. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, TJ, you were going to talk to Riley as well. The first thing I want to ask is if, if there's any one in the guild who might know how to make disguises as a way to maybe disguise the thing with her eyes. Like contact that would require lenses. magic. 
to disguise her eyes. I'd take a really good illusion. Well, so if she does go out in public, it is less evidence. You could ask safety. Mira, or you could ask Nilfarin. Although it would be hard to ask Nilfarin to do anything for you. Who is Nilfarin? Oh, he's the elf over there with the long blonde hair. The one that Damon said was full of himself? Yes. I didn't say anything about him. The one that I said was full of himself. Oh, you. And then I asked her about if she has heard of anyone named Harmony. She just kind of looks from Nelferen to you and then just stares and says, where did you hear that name? I went down to the black market and I talked to one of the thieves there. You went alone? Yes. I feared that if I brought the rest of the group, <sighs> it would bring too much attention. Oh, let's go to the guild. Let's go to the other guild and try to talk to them and see what happens. No, I let's go to the black market. Shut up. Okay. Uh, so you learn from them about harmony. My information points that it, that it was Gary. It has to be her who did this. I okay. saw a girl with a female with pigtails at when we were running towards long the house. about her waist. Often yes. likes to skip. And exactly. Little and brat. Mina, Mina told us those. about a girl with pigtails who threw a, a vial onto the floor before the explosion happened. Harmony is a little brat. And a psychopath. She used to be one of ours. Mm. What happened? She's a psychopath. She's a psychopath and a brat. Uh, well, what did she do? Well, you saw <laughs> I, the results look, of what happened. I look at Riley. It's like, well, I'm just thinking. I imagine that could, that's a bucket different. less long. <laughs> at one you, point, you saw what happened. We actually had to get a new place because of her. It cost a lot of money. Ouch, that's was she always good. this way? Yeah, pretty much. She just kind of wandered in, wanted some money. We gave her a job. She did good. But then at one period, jobs stopped rolling around. It was at a time where everything was good. And so she created her own problems for her to solve. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm just reading, thinking Edward Nigma. So, Sorry. yeah, that is why Harmony is not a part of this guild <laughs> She's anymore. She's not very what? harmonious, is she? What kind of well, uh, jobs did she take? She chose that name for herself because there's always harm in Harmony. Oh, that's good. Okay, well, Deep. let's see if we can bring a little discord to her butt. So, what kind of jobs did she you usually take? To. Killing, destruction. So she was probably an assassin. Her and a no, no. An assassin would not blow no. shit up. No, she she would not do an assassin thing. She's that's not subtle. She's that's way too job. chaotic. Chances are much more likely she did that because she felt like it. You don't think she was maybe hired by the other guild? Unlikely. Okay. Where would one might be able to find her? <laughs> Follow the loud noises. <laughs> yeah, I was... So, I don't know what I was thinking. Other than that, you find her as the best way you can as any other person. I mean, she's not in any one location for much lo for a very long time. She does her own alchemy and such, and... Ah! <sighs> she's a nuisance. She probably really is who we're after. Ha ha ha. She is a nuisance. Like the town jester, but only worse. So I go talk to a dark elf. Not a dark Target. elf. A dark elf with blonde hair. Yeah. No, it's Whatever. not a dark elf. It's no. an elf. <laughs> the elf. No Farron. No Farron. Thank you. I'm assuming it's going to jump to Damon for now. Uh, what is what's Damon doing? But I'm assuming I find Mira in the library like usual then. Yes. Where is, she, is she on the ceiling like usual? No, she's on the floor with a book about cleaning on her head. 
She hasn't moved. She hasn't moved. She's still reading her book. Madam. Hi. And as she looks up, it slides off. <laughs> My book. There's a disturbance in the forest. <laughs> uh, I've come with more information. We're looking for a, a woman named Harmony. Who's she? She blew up the tailor. Apparently she has long pigtails to her waist. Brown hair. Oh. I haven't met her. I heard you know about her I, once. Do you know where we can find her? No. Could you figure out where we could find her? Maybe. I need it. I need absolutes right now. Lives are in danger. Okay. I'll see what I can find. Very well. Anything else? Not that I can think of. Okay. And she goes back to reading. You dropped your book. And she looks at it. And she sees that it's a book on cleaning. And she's like, uh. And she actually closes it and throws it back. <laughs> I'll put one of the random books back on the shelf and then walk out. I was reading that! That! <laughs> Uh, I knew that was coming. And 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 Dave, you hear you hear from upstairs. Hey, I was reading that. Did you? I yell up there. Did you put a book on the shelf? She should read one book at a time. She has a hard enough time with her with her attention span. Riley just starts laughing. I yell like I yell upstairs and tell and ask to find a book of about cleaning and put it on her head. I think she threw that one away. Yeah. Yes, I realized that was very meta. Oh, man. My goodness. All right, well, is there anything else you guys want to do? Adventure time! Oh, weren't we doing something with the wolves, too? <laughs> I was going to talk to the elf. Okay. Uh, what do you ask Nilfarin? I ask him if he knows of any ways one might be able to disguise a cat, someone having a cat's eye. You want to of. disguise... Someone with the eyes of a cat. And you want to disguise their eyes. To help keep them safe. People can't fear what they don't know. Oh, I'm sorry. There. You're going to need something magical for that. I can't do anything. Do you know anyone who does know that kind of stuff? Ask someone magical. But about that, even then it would only be temporary. And they'd have to visit them very often. There's, and it would I be rather I expensive. chime in. There's no... It's a, it'd have to be an illusionary spell. And those are all never... Those are only like six... Good ones would be six hours at a time. <laughs> now, if you don't mind, I really must eat my dinner. I leave him alone. The chicken is good. The chicken is good. <laughs> okay. Uh, anything else from you guys? Shayna, are you doing anything? I'm just following following Dave around. I've got a little follower. You got Yay! a Yay! It's like having a dingleberry, but better. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> oh, dear. I must oh, carry I'm your burdens. A dingleberry. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, and with that, we are going to end the no. session. No! It is time. All right, okay. TJ. Shout outs, man. What? Shout outs. What are you going to say? Things. I have nothing else to say. Dave, shout outs. <laughs> Hi, my name's Panzer. You can occasionally find me on twitch.tv slash. Panzer Dave, you will find me every Friday night at twitch.tv slash Joey Girl entertaining the masses, i.e. being stupid with our community night there. Um, other than that, I stream occasionally when I'm not uh, in school or at work. Okay. Ludwig, shout outs. I'm Ludwig von Damon. You may remember me from such films such as Radioactive Man, Radioactive Man 2, Bring on the Sequel, or Radioactive Man 3, Oh God, Not Again. 
You can find me at twitch.tv slash Ludwig Von Damon, where I'm currently doing a Forge Piesa of Final Fantasy V, or tomorrow night you can find me over at Mr. Jack LaFear's channel as he's playtesting a new game that he's been working on for his Earthbound Survivor. Cool! <laughs> Major! Shoutouts. Hi, I'm Major Sidepants. I do really bad accents, a really good Donald, Donald, Donald Duck impression, and I... Uh, stream on twitch.tv slash major tie pants and tomorrow well later today at 12 a.m. my time I will be doing a 24 hour live stream playing through the first four Silent Hill games wow I have no idea why I'm awake right now wow <laughs> you did it because I asked you very nicely do you want to be in our group <laughs> oh dear that that is literally oh. how it happened, right after Pretty Jack's up call. Hey, mm. do, you, do you want to be in our group? Can you be awake at this time? Okay. Would you like to join a cult? Would you like to drink some Kool Aid? Would totally you like to play a point. game? <laughs> Live or die. Little did she it's know when choice. she signed up, she would be uh, subjected to all this torture. All I know, I'm, of I'm, this no, I'm subjecting you every guys. Day. I'm subjecting you guys to plenty of torture. No, we love answer. you. Don't, don't All say right. that. Well, guys, I'm the Foot Knight. You know where the channel is because you're already here. And if you're on YouTube, twitch.tv slash the Foot Knight. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash the Foot Knight. And uh, we will be scheduling the next session at a later time. It will probably be two weeks from now, uh, hopefully. And other than that, there might be some random Monster Hunter streams along the uh, week. And we will just have to see. Fighting if you don't drop steel beams on your foot! Yeah, that hurt. A lot. Your foot can't melt steel beams? No, I dropped a 50 pound steel beam on my left foot. It hurt. A oh, lot. yeah. When did this happen? Uh, yesterday. Twitter Ow. is good for information. Twitter is good for information. When things aren't going by faster than you can read them. Yesterday, all his <laughs> pain seemed to come away. Wow! <laughs> Wow, Ludwig, wow. And with that, we're going to end. All right, guys. I will see you later. Love you all. Everyone wave. Bye. Bye. And there is a walrus. Bye. And wrong screen. Great.